San Diego is full of fun and unique communities and Hillcrest is probably near the top of that list. Today I want to show you what makes Hillcrest so special from the things to do, the places to visit, the pros and cons, and what it's like living here. So Hillcrest is located north of downtown San Diego in Bankers Hill. It's right next to Balboa Park. So it's actually one of the most walkable communities in all of San Diego. And you get access to all the various communities around Balboa Park as well. So you have North Park, South Park, Mission Hills. There's so much to do, so much to see. This is the place to be. So the history of Hillcrest is actually pretty interesting. Hillcrest, along with a lot of these other communities with close proximity to downtown San Diego, were developed in the early 1900s. They were all connected by class one streetcars. So that's why you'll see a lot of 100 year old craftsmen and Spanish style homes because it was developed in the early 1900s. What's unique about Hillcrest in particular is by the 1960s, a lot of these homes became run down with longtime residents. This really became kind of an elderly community. So that led to a major revitalization and transformation of Hillcrest in the 1970s, 1980s, predominantly by the LGBT community. And now this uptown neighborhood is widely known for having great cafes, restaurants, bars, lots of things to do, very walkable community. Ooh, that sugar sweet, you got what I need. Sipping on the potion, all that good emotion, just like I need. Keep it on repeat, tasting by the motion, loving this devotion. So you'll actually see a lot of buildings like this over in Hillcrest and in Bankers Hill. Uh, kind of an industrial, modern feel, uh, a lot of concrete, metalwork, floor to ceiling windows. This is where you get the penthouse style suites here in San Diego. So all right, I've mentioned walkability here a bunch of times and with good reason. Walkability in Hillcrest is a 10 out of 10. Bikeability, probably a 12 out of 10. One thing that people don't realize when moving to San Diego is San Diego is actually a fairly hilly place. So it can make it a little bit more challenging if you're gonna walk or bike around. But as you can see right behind me, it is very flat here in Hillcrest. It's very flat around the surrounding communities. So it makes it easy to get around. And then you have these bike paths all over the place as well. It's a great place to be for walkability. So beyond restaurants and shops, one of the reasons that we really loved living in Hillcrest was because the proximity to Balboa Park. And in Balboa Park, you have the zoo, you have museums, you have a dog park, you have a disc golf course, you have a golf course. There's endless supplies of things to do in Balboa Park. But honestly, what we probably did the most is just kind of take some time, hang out, lay in the grass, have a little picnic. This is a fantastic place to just come relax. So Hillcrest also happens to be the place where Steph and I went on our first date and Ortega's Mexican restaurant went for happy hour as some broke college kids. It was awesome. All right, I've talked a big game about how easy it is to get around in Hillcrest. Let me show you how easy it is. So when Steph and I lived over here, this was one of our regular spots. I'm kind of thankful we moved away because <laughs> I would eat here all the time. Do you guys eat here all the time? You just live right down the street. Not as much as we should, but three bucks a slice, like always ready. Yeah. So this is Bronx pizza, New York style pizza by the slice. And I think I just saw recently they're ranked number seven out of a hundred of the top pizza places across the US. I believe it. They know what they're doing. They've been doing they know what the they're same doing. thing for a long time. They don't change it and they're always busy. All right, well, I'm hungry. Let's check it out. One of these 
pepperoni, sausage, meat lovers, whatever that guy is. I'll do a pesto. You're folding now, though. Oh, I fold. Oh, yeah. Or else it flops. Well, it's, it's, you have to fold with mm -hmm. the New York style pizza. Mm -hmm. All you folding over there? <laughs> so, Andrew, you live in Mission Hills, which is a neighboring community. Yep. What do you like about Hillcrest? What do you like about living in this area? Honestly, it's got just a little bit of everything. Everything from shops and boutiques to restaurants and breweries, and it's you can hop on a bike and be there. And I mean, it's almost like you shouldn't drive just because it's, it's right there. In fact, the parking over here is not so great, but the walkability is fantastic. So if you want to walk or bike places, that's great. Just having to drive everywhere if you want to stay in this community can be a little bit of a challenge. Yeah, it's one of those communities that like you don't want to, you sometimes don't want to move your car. And yeah. you can walk to dinner, to go grocery shopping, to you know grab a glass of wine, sushi, whatever it is, you can find it. And who would you say this community is for? Like, what's the ideal type of person to live in Hillcrest? I think a little bit of everyone, but definitely someone that, you know, a younger professional that wants something within a, a medium price range, but also wants the lively culture that comes with living somewhere like Hillcrest or, you know, the proximity to the other surrounding neighborhoods. Yeah, a lot of condos and townhomes. Yep. So it's going to be a, a lot less maintenance. You don't have to worry about single family home, yards, um, exterior maintenance. You're going to have a very low maintenance property, which is great for business professionals. You have accessibility to everything that you need centrally located in San Diego. I think there's a lot of people that kind of fall into those brackets. I think it's like a majority of the people. Plus at the same time, you're 10 minutes to the airport too. If you travel, you've got friends coming, like it's so easy just in and out. So if you're talking about a house to live in, condos, townhomes, starting at around 600,000, you get way more affordability with that. But at the same time, I mean, there's single family homes that are, you know, a million dollars, but you get a house with a yard and a garage. And you know, if you're family oriented, that's definitely, there's definitely plenty of them. Yeah, I think probably around the $1.2 million mark is where you're going to find single family homes in Hillcrest. And you're probably going to have to get a little bit patient because there's only four or five on the market right now today. Hillcrest will always have a very special place in my heart. And to be honest, it's still one of my favorite places to show homes. Although parking can be a bit of a challenge when you're going from one place to the next. But it's hard to pinpoint exactly what is so special about Hillcrest. I recommend you come check it out for yourself. So if you are looking to buy or sell a house here in Hillcrest or anywhere else in San Diego County, my team and I, we would love to help. Feel free to reach out. Our contact info is down below. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.